we need patients and primary care clinicians to partner to save primary care. We need patients and primary care clinicians to come together to collaboratively not only design what primary care should look like, but to advocate for the remediation of the various obstacles that stand in the way. I'm talking about the crazy reimbursement rates that drive the short, short visit. I'm talking about those crazy insurance company policies and strategies where they're regularly dumping primary care providers from their network. I'm talking about the regulations, the protocols, and the rules that have your average primary care practitioner essentially handcuffed to the computer. Patients and clinicians need to come together to mobilize and leverage their collective power. Now, in order to do this, though, we're going to have to get real. We're going to have to get real with each other. Okay, we're going to have to start talking about the elephant in the room, our common pain in primary care, right? So just like those conversations that we all used to have with our significant others, we're like, you know, uh, I just want to talk about how this is not working for me, and I want to talk about it with you, sweetie. Okay, we need to have a similar conversation with our primary care providers, maybe just a toned down version of it. So picture this. Next time you're in your primary care office and your primary care practitioner is finishing up the visit and she's walking over and she's got her hand on the door and you're basically done, picture yourself doing this. Wait, I want to ask you a question. How are you doing right now? I get the sense that this system is not working for you. It's definitely not working for me. And I would love to know if there's something we can do together to make it work for us.